Okay then guys, and this is the next stop. Still on the uh, causeway, the uh, sea coast as you can see. Nice and windy. Don't know if you can hear me with that wind. But we're at the castle now. There you go, that's the castle. Proper windy here guys. Waterfall there, look bad. See what you can see from here, guys, but there's a waterfall right over on the sort of halfway across the uh, cliff edge. We'll just get a quick photograph of that. Just get down to all these, all of them. They were on, uh, on a nice day with the sunrise or something, they'd be cracking there, Rude. I said, done, guys. <laughs> Take the gloves off, done, because it's carrying everything. Oh, that's a bit nice down there. Is it past the castle, look? That's the castle there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That's all the way down to it. It's all that again, sorry. That's the castle down there guys, so we've got the moody sky behind it, so that's looking quite nice. They've got a cracking path here as you can see. You know, you go off the edge of there. Oh, they've got a bit of windbreak as well now, because we're sort of lower than the embankment. No drones allowed, according to the signs. No overnight parking at this place. You okay? Little known. Comments below. <laughs> So guys, the next uh, stop is going to be uh, some rope fencing, it's all rope bridge. It's going to be a rope bridge. So, that looks a bit dodgy to be honest with you. Especially in these winds, it's proper dodgy. Ooh. Well, there ain't much of a castle left guys, but uh, Go down there and do a bit of photography. Pass half out away. Nice some buildings down there as well, some old buildings.
Do the walk guys across the top of there, but are you going to do it? Too windy for my liking. Let's see if I can photograph some of this waterfall up here. Quite nice. Fun get an angle on it. The wind's actually stopping it. And I've seen it actually go backwards. Back up. I don't think you see that guys. The wind's just catching sending it back up. Right, I'm gonna switch you off. Get it. Okay guys, parked up again. There we have it. On a lovely big car park. There's no signs on here saying that we can't stop overnight. However, there's no internet connection. And I've got to have internet connection today because my daughter is in Jamaica. And she's getting married this afternoon. And she's then putting a sort of a link on on the uh, phone or on there. So, um, yeah, so uh, we've got to uh, have an internet connection for that. Best not miss that, seems I, seems I never went flew on the other side of the world to go and watch her get married. And there you go. So we've part there, guys. We're going to go and have a look at uh, this rope bridge. And um, the problem what we got, it's a National Trust car park, which I have a problem, we, we have National Trust members. We pay it every year, pay our money to them every year. But this car park, they've put a height restriction barrier on it, so we can't get the bloody van in. Now, <clears throat> and I'm chatting away here, and you probably ain't bothered, but it's about a mile walk from off that car park. That's the only car park I could find. What was anywhere near close to it. Oh yeah, that bothered about doing to be honest with you. Dawn wanted to do it. So we've got to walk the mile, which is all downhill. And then it's all up along the way back. Brilliant. Like we had enough walking today. There you go. Here is look. Got a smile on the face. Got a smile on the face. Don't give a shit about those old pensioners. Kiss. The kids forgetting that. The kids forgetting that, guys. I have got to go back. Oh, I got my camera. And now, guys, I'm just walking back. Could I forgot my camera? And of course, we could go there, can we? Without the camera. Never mind doing us a few more steps. <laughs> oh dear me! Right, guys, I'm gonna turn you off, and I'm gonna turn you on again down to the bridge. <laughs> And then we have guys, eventually, we've got to it, the entrance. Let me show you what I mean. Don't understand why they've done this, to be honest. Unless they stop people in vans from parking in here on the night. I suppose that could be it. There you go. National Trust. And it is locked, so there's no way of getting around it. For non-members, if you're a member, it's free, which we am, guys. For non-members, £15.50. That's a bit of a kick in the teeth, isn't it? For a non-member. Don't gallivanting off. Oh, that's a laugh. That's just some laughing, guys, if, uh, if we get down here and it's shut. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my oh, oh. Done. That's why I said them should stop at three. 
Josh? So might be going down, but car parks and cottage. Should be next even more down, you'll just see even more uphill on the way back. Car behind you. Done. There you go, watch them guys while they're driving. We've got a few fields though, guys, how green that is all the way around. I show, just got to show you how much water they've had around here. Happy days. Go find this bloody bridge. Right, we're going to put you away, guys. I'll turn you back on when we get to this bridge. Now, earlier on, you're telling me lies about you forgot the tickets. So uh, we already uh, found out yeah, what this uh, bridge is all about. Obviously it takes uh, to this rock or uh, what are we going to call it? Out at sea. What word on it? Is it just goes into a reception or is it worth it? It is worth it. So What's the point of it? Is that the point? No. Just don't die. Don't Just do whatever we don't die. <laughs> you, you, you mind your butt from what time you got to the top of there. At the top of these stairs is a defibrillator, but I didn't see one up here. Oh, <laughs> no, it's okay. You have to live. <laughs> Take care. Don't die. What's the point of it, don't die? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. So guys, the point of this walk, many people with me, the point of this walk is not to die. I should reckon them by. I know what it does, but what's on the oak crop? What's the point of the oak crop? Why why there? Why not the one over the over you know behind us? I'm going to ask. I'm going to put it on record. You probably don't know yourself. <laughs> He'll go, I don't know, I'm only taking money. Ask a tour guide. Oh, that's right, look, there's an heart attack thing ready. That's a good sign, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> You're in the right place. Yes. <laughs> It might be so you can come and visit all the birds. So that's a mini. There's no way around there, look. Oh, that ain't much of a bridge is this. There must be another one done. <laughs> you give me tickets there, guys? Hello. What's the, what's the point of this bridge? The purpose of it was for the fishermen to get across to the island because the character reef means rock in the road and it's where the salmon swam around. So when you get over, you'll see a fisherman's cottage. Right, okay. No access to it, but you'll see it. And there's little interpretation panels. And what they did was they uh, threw their nets out and they caught the salmon that way. 
So it was a way of getting so over was, it and bringing back baskets of, um, baskets of salmon. No longer, but that was the main reason. That was the old idea of the bridge. Yeah. Excellent. I've always wanted to know. Well, there you go. <laughs> and I said, I oh, will ask. Oh, always And do. there you go. Thank you. come across okay I'm glad they got their auto attack machine up the other end. <laughs> That's a bit early, wasn't it? Here's a fisherman's cottage. So the whole idea was it, the bridge, the whole idea of the bridge is for the fishermen to get on here, to catch the salmon, to get them back on the mainland. So guys, I don't know how much of the, uh, well I don't know yet, I'll know, I'll know later on tonight, and, and you already know by now what I'm, what, I'm, what I'm saying, but I don't know how much I actually got myself filmed, but it was well, well blowy going across there, and my camera, which is on the strap, kept getting caught on the bloody bridge, so it was a very good experience. And there you go. So we're more roped off. I don't know if uh, this is uh, whether you can even hear me. But obviously it's roped off to stop people wandering to the edge. I don't think uh, I'd be too happy about paying uh, 15 quid to come across. Well, it would have been £31 with, uh, for both of us. I don't think I would have uh, swallowed that very well, to be fair. I think it was worth 15 quid to come across. Nah.
Come on in, John. Hello, bubs. Don't tell me to wait here. I know, uh, it's probably be brave than do it with that in the end. Did you see that? Huh? Is it? Oh. Yeah! Go on then, carry on. Well Thanks, bub. Not to wait for it, thank you. Uh, Where's our auto attack machine? <laughs> it takes the light. I don't know. I don't know. Just take a easy gun bag. There's no rush bag. If you want to miss like the set of steps, you can go like past the sky and that. Alright. Like the first step and the first step. Yeah, yeah. We'll be alright with the steps. We'll just take our time.